Hi everyone, welcome to our bi-weekly tutorial. Sounds great. I'm Serene. Hi everyone, I'm Yaki. Yaki, do you have an idea about low-cut filter? Yeah, I know, and it is this symbol. So I often see it on the microphone function display. Yeah, this is the symbol of low-cut filter. It's one of the common function settings of microphones. Uh-huh, so why don't we talk about low-cut filter today? Sure, low-cut filter, also known as a high-pass filter, Basically, it's a type of filter that removes low frequencies from an audio signal. Yes, and normally they are designed to filter out frequencies below a certain determined frequency, often somewhere between 20 Hz and 150 Hz. Then, what benefits can low-cut filter provide in recording practice? Well, low-cut has two main benefits in recording practice to effectively reduce the low frequency noise and to reduce the impact of plosive sounds. That's the point. When recording vocals, low cuts can filter out some low frequency noise to achieve better audio effect. This is because most vocals are above 100 Hz in frequency, while sounds below 100 Hz often come from the surrounding environment, such as car horns or even low frequency noise caused by the circuit. Yes, and in addition, low cuts can reduce the impact of plosive sounds. Plosive sounds are caused by airflow that produce large pressure changes on the microphone diaphragm. When people speak or sing words with hard consonants such as p or b, they usually produce such airflow. So these plosive sounds contain a lot of low frequency information. So a low cut switch may help reduce the sound intensity of these plosive sounds and avoid their impact on audio recording. The above are the two main functions of low cuts in practical applications. However, if you are recording lower frequency sources and your top priority is to capture the most authentic material, then you don't need to use low cuts. Yes, and in fact, our UHF wireless microphone system, WMI-S2, and our shotgun microphone, VDS-M2 and VDS-M3, are all equipped with low-cut function, which can be used for recording in different scenarios and meets various recording needs. 